All right, all right, we just knocked out two model homes. This is part three. This is the Charl Charlie model, I wanna say. We're losing a bedroom here. Roughly the same square footage. We're at 2142, 2124 square feet. And this is a 3-2. So let's check this out. Still gonna get the ring cameras installed for free, right? So upon first entering, you know what? This home is a little bit smaller square footage wise, but I actually like the layout a lot more than the previous home that we just toured. You have a dedicated office space here and you're gonna see just how intricate they actually designed this. So the square footage is a little bit lower, but it's still very, very beautiful. Straight from the office, if we make a left right here, we're actually gonna be greeted with the laundry again. We are losing the utility sink here, but at least it's at the front of the home. Have a great day, guys. God bless you. I hope you guys find out. <laughs> so again, now coming back from this laundry side, we're gonna get into the main living space, but I'm actually gonna open this door and show you guys what's in here. Garage. Again, price point wise, this is gonna be a little bit lower because again, this is a three, two, just over 2,000 square feet, just over 2,100. And you see how they section off everything very, very nicely. So you still have a nice kitchen that's facing, right? The main living space, really, really nice quartz countertops. You get all the appliances, of course, same pantry space. <laughs> I find myself hoping for a bigger pantry every time I go into one in Lenar, but it seems that they keep it rather the same, right? And we're gonna see they actually dedicated two living spaces. So I'm gonna go down this way because the main bedroom is gonna be tucked away in that corner, but we're actually gonna shift to the right. And we're gonna see an additional living space, or rather this is like another main, uh, I don't want to say a bonus, but it's like a congregation area. So just picture this. If you guys are familiar with the next gen homes, this is literally how it would be. They would close this off. You would have another front door over there, like at the entrance. And then this would be like a private guest suite. And I really like this because if you have kids, right? And you want them to have their own little play place, their own area, not be bothering anybody. You have a full bath here, another bedroom here. You have this little play place here, which this is how I envision it. Cause if you have a family, I know if my little brother and I lived in this uh, home, I would carpet this, put like a little fluffy mat so he doesn't get hurt. And this is where all his toys, all his stuff would be. My sister will probably be residing in this bedroom. Built-in closet is the same. And again, the floor plan just makes sense. You know what I mean? It just really makes sense. That's why, again, Lenar, you get two thumbs up for me because um, I really feel like they stepped up the game when it comes to this collection. Again, this is the Charlie model, same screen Lenar. You're gonna get this for any model that you purchase from Lenar. This is more of a hidden doorway because again, from the regular view over there, you really couldn't see. There was a door here. Here's your main bedroom. You have more space uh, width wise rather than length, but still really suitable because you can see you could put a whole full size bed in the middle and still have space to walk around. You get another walk in closet. This one's really, really big as well. So again, these homes, you know, I'm definitely opening. <clears throat> I'm definitely open to answering any questions that you may have regarding what you're seeing, what I'm showing you. Tub here, that one, what the heck? Looks like a little baby tub. <laughs> I don't know why it's so small and low to the ground. Um, you close this door, of course, the toilet's there. And again, it, it makes sense. This is livable. In my opinion, this is more than livable. Should you be in need of a 3-2, uh, this is great. All right, cool. So, yeah, that's all based on starting prices, nice. uh, into the models, HOA, we're floor plans for these five models. Yeah, you're the best, bro. Thank you, you so much. All right, cool. All right, so we're coming back from this little cut. Again, a community like this specifically, the HOA is super, super low. Um, but again, these are gonna range, every home that I'm showing you is gonna range from the low 300s to the mid 400s. The low to mid 400s at that. Um, let me know what you think of this one. I honestly like this one and the medallion. These are my two favorites. The one next door is still great. I just like that this one is a little more unique, right? Home sites and all that stuff. If you curious in a sense as to what size lot, is available for these to be built on. I can definitely provide you all that without a problem. Just make sure you reach out to my contact info below and I'll be very, very happy to assist you in your entire process as far as looking for a home and at least just providing you info. Cause again, I know it gets stressful scrolling on Zillow. You're probably scrolling on Trulia, something like that. 
And for you to be spending hours and hours scrolling through homes, not really knowing where they are, looking at beautiful homes, not knowing exactly where they're located, it's the worst feeling ever. So that's where I'm here essentially to be your eyes and ears, whether you're out of state or you already live here, I would love to be able to help you. So Brandon Polito, thank you so much. Let's get into part four.